So for reference today, this video is going to be a little bit different because I am facing an actual crossroads um, near my house, which you can't really see from here, but I can see it from where I'm sitting. So um, as usual, my back is to the woods and I don't know, you can kind of see the traditional New England stone walls that we have around here and just get kind of a look at things and because it is a crossroads and this is during the day you will be hearing traffic going like in and out of the area so that's kind of why I'm not standing on the actual crossroads and also because um you know you see all the houses and the street and stuff and honestly I just prefer the woods background a lot more um and what happens with a lot of people when they consume a lot of content online and download lots of freebies and look into a lot of different coaches and potential mentors and things like that is they come to a space where they realize they've looked at all of like the freebies and stuff that they could possibly consume but they're still not seeing the results that they want in their life and one of my friends recently asked the question like what do you think about freebie seekers and you know there were like some mixed reactions but one of the ones that stood out for me is well they're potential clients there are people who might buy your thing because they got your free thing so they might want to actually buy your thing and I've definitely been in that space of being a freebie seeker myself where I'm checking out other coaches content or even not coaches but other service providers energy healers, mentors, consultants, people with different services. And I'm checking it out to determine if it's something that I want to or need to invest in. And honestly, most of the time the answer ends up being no, and not necessarily because like, I really dislike that person, but because it's not quite the right fit. And also because sometimes I don't really understand my problem as well as I initially thought I did. So for the longest time I thought, I have a copywriting problem, I have a copywriting problem. My problem is I don't know how to write good copy and it just like would play back and forth in my head. And what I didn't realize is what I really had was a mindset issue. And the copy was just a symptom of the mindset issue. And the copy not being seen was also a symptom of the mindset issue. So sometimes we look at things and they're symptoms. They're not the actual problem. And when we're in this space where we don't know what the actual problem is, we know we have a problem or we would have the thing that we desire and we're sitting there and we're like, I don't know what the actual problem is. And it's easy to end up getting stuck in that for a really, really long time. And this is what a really good coach can help you with. But not just any coach because there's like tons and tons of different types of coaches out there with different areas of expertise and where they ask different questions. But one of the reasons why I decided to do this video at the crossroads today is because there's like a certain energy of the crossroads and when you're on the crossroads in your life and in your business that is one of the best times to hire a coach a coach who can really help you see where you want to go from where you're at. And if you're 
at a crossroads with your audience development where you kind of have an audience and some people coming in and buying your stuff, but not as many as you would like. That is when you want to come to me because that's something that I'm really, really good at. 